Congratulations, guys. You guys have made it through our section two. So let's go through our conclusion for Introduction to Pearl. So what did you learn in this section? Well, we learned how to install and set up our Pearl environment successfully. If you have any questions, you can definitely let, let me know if you need to go over something again. But again, we've learned how to properly use our skills learned and set up our Perl environment to begin testing and deploying our Perl applications for the real world. And again, we've created our first Perl program. I went over all of the basic skills and step by step explaining what everything does piece by piece. I've shown you the examples of my personal advanced Perl programs and shown you what the purposes are. And the whole reason of doing this is to let you guys know what a real world Perl application feels like when you go out to the outside world and you want to work for companies and show them your work and how it applies to them and how it, it can benefit them so again I showed you guys you know some real life examples of what pro applications look like more and more sophistication and pretty much that's it so I'll see you guys in our next lecture